Hello everybody, thank you so much for joining me today. I'm going to be sharing with you my favorite everyday eyeshadow look that really make my green eyes pop. So I'm starting off with that light orangey color from the Wet n Wild Comfort Zone palette and this is gonna be my transition and blending shade. I'm using my Sigma E35, I think. I always forget and I'm just blending this in the crease and in the outer V and then now this is the color that's really gonna make my eyes pop it's like a warmish reddish brown and that red really brings out green eyes you can also use purple but for me I feel like red is a little bit easier to wear I mean I love wearing purple eyeshadow but this is a little bit more like daytime appropriate so I'm putting this in the crease in the outer V and I'm just kind of going back and forth a lot I want you know I like things blended so I'm going back and forth with that Real Techniques brush. Now I'm blending the edges out with that light orange shade, that first color that I used. And I just want to mention this red isn't like a pinky red, so it's not going to make you look sickly or anything like that. It's a nice warm red. Now I'm going in with this Derma E spray. I love these sprays. And I'm going to spray my brush and then pick up that light shimmery shade. You guys might think I'm crazy, but I am laying down this light shimmery shade just across my whole entire lid. I'm also going to blend it out with my crease colors just so everything is well blended as per usual but because this color for me is just a little too bright I wanted to tone it down a little bit so on top I'm putting this darker shimmery color which is almost like a little orangey a little red and when I put that on top it just tones it down a little bit makes it more wearable but you still have that kind of glowy look I really love the way it looks I've tried this look with just the light shimmery color it's just too light for me I try it just with the darker shimmery color and then it's too dark but maybe Mixing it is like the perfect all over the lid color. So I'm doing that and then of course blending everything out so everything's nice and seamless. And guys, I just want to mention this tutorial took me literally 10 minutes. Um, it takes no time. So I feel like it's super easy, great for the mornings. And then I'm going with, con with concealer, of course, to face born this way, multi-use sculpting concealer. Um, my eyeshadow wasn't that messy I probably didn't have to clean it up but I just like doing this I like highlighting right underneath the eye because I have hooded eyes I feel like this kind of just brightens up and um, just lifts my eyes if you guys want like a hooded eye tutorial specifically I can do that for you just let me know and then of course setting the under eyes with the Too Faced Born This Way ethereal setting powder The one shade that this palette doesn't have is like a light matte cream to highlight right underneath your eyebrow. So I just use this setting powder. Um, you can also use your under eye setting powder. I don't know why I didn't use mine. I probably just had this one closer, but I'm just blending out the edges and highlighting right underneath my eyebrow with that. And then I'm gonna be taking the red color, putting it right on the outer third of my lower lash line. I feel like putting this color on the lower lash line just really gives an extra umph to my eyes. And then I'm blending the lower lash line out with that that light orangey color. And then basically to finish off the whole look, I'm using my favorite mascara. It's the Essence False Lash Effect Lash Princess Mascara. You guys, you guys know what I mean. I'll link it down below. And that concludes my absolute favorite everyday eyeshadow look. If you guys enjoyed this video and if you enjoy my tutorials in general, it would mean the world to me if you subscribed. But let me know what you think about this look and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!